This is my video diary, August 6, 7.30 a.m., 2012. Conquering the beast. I'm prepared. Paul's gaiters and boots, backpack. I am ready to go on the trail. Oh, which mountain? Not Washington. <laughs> Very good. The journey has started. The climbing has begun. I'm so prepared for this. Three miles. I've climbed 0.3 miles. I'm gonna do it. It's wet, slippery, and I'm tougher than the mountain. easy so far. Relatively calm, quiet. Right? Beautiful stream out into the distance. Beautiful blue sky. You see the clouds coming in. Watch the dismount. Conquering the beast. Well, we're not above the tree line yet, as you can see, but we're getting there. Beautiful waterfalls, then ponds, beautiful, beautiful.
good. Going good. Almost noon. Been hiking since 7.30. We did have one incident though. It was just rocks. Just rocks. That's all it was. Sheer rocks. Bruce was ahead of me. I was holding his hand. And I said, wait, just wait. I started to panic a little. I said, Bruce, no, you gotta wait. I'm not gonna cry. I am not going to cry. I am going to conquer the beast. We got 1.4 miles to go. It's almost two o'clock. Probably take us a couple hours. Gotta be there by 5.30 for the cog. It was tough going. This could be your last video. This could be my last video. Well, it's a little after two and we're attempting the summit of Mount Washington. And this is the cabin for the AMC has up here. And the weather is actually pretty nice, except for the wind. And as they say, for the ceiling, which seems to be rising with us today. So we're very lucky to have the views. This isn't easy, this part of it. That's all I'm saying. That's it? That's it. This is where the anxiety kicks in. Look at it. Go show. Turn around. Look what I got to deal with. Elevation. It's like too much already. only nine hours to get to the top. A typical four hour hike. It's nine hours. Okay, so I am slow. But what did I learn from this? What did I learn? I will never, ever, ever in my life climb a mountain again. In fact, I've only climbed two mountains in my life. Mount Washington twice in 1982 and 2012. 
I will mm. never do it again. I'll do the Greenway. I'll do the Finger Lakes Trail. I'll go for a walk. What was so... Well, how come you would never do it again? I don't get it. I don't see the trail. <laughs> I know those, what are those things called? Karens. The Karens, which are trail markers above the tree line, I learned today. I thought it was for some memorial for somebody. <laughs> I never didn't know it was a trail. I didn't know there was. How many oh. times? So these were some of the quotes from today. This isn't easy. Just take little baby steps. <laughs> I'll do it. Just little babies. Oh, that was a big one. Okay, now I got now we got to rest. <laughs> Put your hood up. Then you won't have to see anything. No, it's like you said, I don't like I looking I down. I don't like looking down. I said, put your hood up, then you won't see it yeah. down. And then people would question us. Are you okay? Do you need help? <coughs> Why? Because this is how I was on the trail. I couldn't look up. I couldn't <laughs> Show us how big your steps were. You didn't walk that fast. <laughs> She's speeding it up. Okay. So one guy finally asked me, Do you, are you okay? Do you need help? But I said, what, do you got a tow rope? I'm like, how, what's going to happen? This isn't easy. All right. What about the two guys who's... Oh, they said, we looked good. We looked good. Good. They said, we only wish we looked that good. Oh, we got the stuff. It was exhilarating.